I want to quickly talk to you today about the Power BI update and the preview features. Power BI is a relatively new software. It was only released in 2015. And every month, the Power BI team release a new update. And this update includes a host of new features. Now, sometimes these features are new connectors. They could be new visualizations or updates to existing visualizations. They can be new calculation methods, and sometimes they are also released in preview. Now, what does preview mean? Well, preview means that it hasn't been released into the main feature of Power BI. And if you use preview features, you get the opportunity to give your feedback to Power BI, to the Microsoft team on the feature before it's released into the live. So these preview features are usually work in progress preview features. Now to update your Power BI every month, all you need to do is go to the Power BI website and download Power BI as you did when you first installed it. Then you click run and the Power BI will automatically update them for you. In addition to this then, you should also keep an eye on the Power BI blog because the Power BI blog will give an announcement of all the features that are included in the most recent updates of Power BI. So to turn on the preview feature, if you go to file and then you go to options and to settings and then go to options. And in here in options, you will find the preview features under global. And these are all of the features that are currently available for preview. Now I have the new matrix visual ticked and I have quick measures ticked. And you'll see here when you select one, this here is my matrix preview. And the matrix preview, is, it will allow you to do an awful lot more things than the original matrix visualization. Let me just show you an example. Visualization here is an example of my matrix preview. Now, if we change this back to the original preview, we'll see that items are not clickable. So when you click them, it doesn't cross filter all of your other reports. But one of the neat things about the matrix filter is that when you highlight something, it's going to cross filter it against the rest of your reports. So that's a really, really cool thing that you can do now with the preview feature matrix visualization. And don't forget that this has not yet moved into mainstream. So my advice to you is make sure that you keep your Power BI up to date. Always make sure you are using the most recent version. Keep an eye then on the Microsoft blog so you can get tips and tricks on how to use the new features, any new connectors, any new visualizations or calculation methods that they have released.